standing up when greeting people, quite simple. It shows respect. Mm -hmm. So you go to hotels, and I do feel sorry for some of the people who just stood on their feet all day. But even if it's not your, your case, if you stood on your feet all day, if somebody comes in, it just shows that ultimate respect when you stand up to, to greet them. So when somebody comes in and does that, if you do that, they'll get a liking for you. Again, increasing your chance of rapport, increasing your chance of getting a sale from them by standing up. Head tilt. There's a few head tilts here, so that's good news. <laughs> <laughs> that shows that you're listening to somebody, because people tend to just cock their head and just really, when they're listening, maybe because it's their better ear, are listening to you. Now, as I said, be genuine. Don't just tilt your head and then not actually take on board what they're saying, because that goes against the pain. But people will feel comfortable. They'll feel that they're saying something interesting when you're talking to them. And that's great. I think it's great as well to make somebody feel comfortable. And the more comfortable somebody feels, the more chances they are likely to buy from, from you. Two button jackets as opposed to three button jackets. Now, why is this? The reason being is because if you go to like, the archetypal villains in films, they're often buttoned right the way up to the top. And it gives out that, that signal, I'm closed, I'm shut down, I'm, I'm not open and honest. Whereas you think to some of the heroes, and particularly here, when you go to uh, the Greek heroes, they would often be naked, their chest, their torso would be shown. Also, well, they're rather shaped like a V. Now, politicians, if you watch the Westminster News, try in vain to look open and honest, uh, but, and you actually <laughs> will see that none of the people who are in the, the Parliament in, in Westminster will be wearing a three-button jacket. It's always two-button jackets. Now, if I've got a client that I feel is particularly difficult, I wear a one-button jacket because in a situation like that, I'm taking no chances. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'll go back to that. And funny enough, I had a, had a councillor once, and he was a councillor that was part of the local government, and he was shocked when he heard that news that people do not like three-button jackets. And he said, well, I'll admit that I wear a three-button jacket when I do like presentations in front of people. However, after that, it got slightly worse for him because people do not like brown suits, and he was wearing a brown three-button jacket suit. So he decided not to use that one again. <laughs>